what's up? Welcome back to Doc's Boost. So as you can see here, there's the Doc's Boost car. I say we're out here at Bondurant Track. That's the uh, High Performance Driving School Bondurant, and uh, we're going to be on that track today for about three or four sessions, and it's going to be a great time. I'm going to actually trail a driver to kind of learn the line of this track, and uh, once we get going, it's going to be a great day. So session two is coming up. This track is going to have about uh, 50 turns in it, you know, all, and it's going to be a great time. Uh, that's Whitey up in front of me, and uh, I'm going to be chasing Whitey today. Well, session two. Let me around the track for session one. I'm going to chase him around the track this time around. <laughs> Here we go. Guy trying to antagonize me. Oh. We're off. Here we go. Nice. All right. We are the track. Uh, heading for turn four, pretty much. And that turn is a little bit of a blind turn downhill, and you can kind of see that green elevation right there. Heading into well, that was turn three. This turn four. That's the gravel pit to the right. Uh, I have some experience in that gravel pit. So once you're in, it's a really hard time getting out, I tell you. All right, this is, these are turns of five, six, seven, and eight, nine are pretty much uh, straight through for the most part. Uh, try to get as much speed as we can. Of course, this is the first lap under yellow flag, so we're just kind of taking a, a scenic route. Through the, through the turns for this, this time around. Uh, this is a uh, part of the track that when we do Mondo, that we combine the main track with, uh, with this portion of uh, Bondurant's track. So it's, it's, uh, but I've never done just Bondurant before. That's so here we go. Coming across, and we are uh, now uh, coming up to uh, full speed not top speed, full speed, uh, which is appropriate for the track and for uh, skill, I guess. Uh, anyway, here we go. Let me try to kind of chase it quite here on the track. Turn four. There's that there, gravel pit. Getting out of there safe this time around. And uh, here we are. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. tight right turn before we head into the looper and that's, uh, that's coming up here in just short time here there we go there's nine then ten sharp right heading into the looper job to uh, get me more familiar and more you know, at ease with the whole thing. There we go, flat out. Running as fast as I can, pedal to the pedal, chasing that blue Mustang of white ease. And again, a little bit of a downhill, and it needs to turn four again. Coming up from four, Five, six, seven, pretty much straight line right through there. And this track has some white marks on it. You may have noticed, or kind of noticed, I noticed, uh, in some places are supposed to be right over it, some places mostly supposed to be to the right of those white marks on the uh, pavement. Gives you a place to aim for, the position, to be in the right position to uh, run the track is, is a best thing. You might have just noticed one there. For the most part, uh, kind of in the best place. Don't always get there every lap, so I'm not as consistent, but I'm working on it.
back's gonna be the, this race here, this, this session, the my last session of the day, and it'll also be the last session this car will be driven with the stock suspension setup. Any videos you see with me on the track from here on out is gonna have a uh, corner carving SBP Ford Performance full suspension. Way bar, big and heavy, some lowering springs, front and rear, adjustable shocks, adjustable struts, a bar links billet style for the back, and uh, it's going to set the car down just a little bit lower, not too much lower, but it's going to be flat firm, and then I can adjust it when I'm not on the track, and that's going to be pretty exciting. So I'm going to Mustang, not on the track from time to time with adjustable struts. Stay safe and always buckle up. We'll see you soon.